Do you passing more? Is the quality of your passing and, and setting up plays any better when you look at the numbers you've put up so far this season? Um, you know what, I've always prided myself on just trying to be versatile, whether it be uh, finishing or creating some plays. So um, I think for me it's kind of come in waves, just different streaks of scoring goals and different streaks where I'm kind of seeing it a little better and trying to uh, move the puck around uh, a little bit more. So I think uh, it's something I've always kind of prided myself on being able to do that. You played with some great passers in your time in Toronto. Put into perspective what Mitch has done and, and specifically that play against Montreal on Saturday night. Yeah, he's really good at just buying himself the extra time and uh, really good at using his uh, his feet to, to get himself into good positions and uh, put the uh, defense on their heels. So he's been, uh, again, doing a good job of that and just been trying to get open and get to the net and uh, he's been able to find me. What do you think the break has done for this room? Yeah, it's always, I mean, you got to take advantage of uh, times you get to recover and recoup and relax a little bit just because it's such a, a long year and the games are coming fast and furious. So I think uh, that's what we try to do is take, and take advantage of that time to, to rest and uh, hopefully we can uh, pick up where we left off before the break. Has the novelty of coming to this building changed in any way from when you were a kid growing up uh, in nearby New Jersey? No, it's always, this is a special place for me to play. Uh, I always love playing here and uh, Lots of uh, great memories of uh, coming to games here growing up, and uh, it's always been a place I've uh, enjoyed playing at. You guys have played a lot of helter-skelter types of games lately, in the third periods in particular. Is that something that you see calming down maybe in the second half? I mean, you want it to, but is that sort of an experience thing too where it calms down? Yeah, you know, I think, again, we've, I think we've, we've made a lot of progress in that area uh, over the course of the year, and it's something we need to continue to get better on. I mean, it should be automatic. Uh, we we want to make it automatic when we're in the third periods of the league. We want to be able to close out games, and uh, that's what the good teams do is they just just basically lock it up, and uh, and that's pretty much the game when you have a lead in the third period.